Hi. Uh, welcome to my channel. Um, I'm Joyful Death. I'm very awkward, and um, I'm starting a new series called Maze. If you could tell by the letters, there it's kind of messy. Um, so I've had this game in my library for a very long time. And um, I thought it looked kind of funny, the teddy bear thing and the talking corn. And it, it looked kind of entertaining. Uh, talked to my friend Briar. He said he played maybe 30 minutes of it. He was going to do a playthrough of it. He said it was very puzzly, so we'll see. We're going to give it a shot. Um, but since I did just finish the Payne's Creek Killings, I figured um, we need to start on something else. So let's give this a shot and we'll see how far we make it. Hopefully we'll make it through the whole thing. Um, let me know what you guys think. Uh, have you guys played this game? Um, are you interested in this game? I don't know. Let's see. And then also don't forget that I live stream on Twitch on Mondays, Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays from 9 p.m. Central Time until 1 a.m. usually. And then also Friday afternoons from about 1 p.m. until 4, 4 p.m. So, and I, I stream that with Insane Sider, my good British friend. All right. Let's give this a shot. I'm on acid. Okay. Oh, it's loud. I thought I adjusted the volume, but it was hard to tell because... Oh, I'm slightly transparent. Okay, question now is... Okay, there's controller support. Or you can use WASD. Let's try tr controller, see. See if we like it. Okay, none of the other buttons do anything. That dot is kind of distracting. Graphics aren't, like phenomenal, but they're not horrible. They're a little blurry. It, this is meant for 1270 was the highest uh, resolution, <clears throat> excuse me, resolution the screen would go, and I'm playing on like a 3040, like 3040, so I might be experiencing some stretch. <laughs> I'm not sure how it's looking for you. Hopefully it's looking okay for you on your end. Oh, water is that way. Yeah, that makes sense. That's about what I saw. Oh, arrow that way? What's that way? House that way. Okay. Uh, when the pointing hand icon appears... Oh, okay, so I hit A. Open door panel. What? Oh, a slot for hand. Oh, slot for hand, a slot for key, and a circular slot. All right. All right. So I'm gonna go this way. Oh, mm, oh. I press escape or P. Hopefully it's that. Okay, it's that. Ah! How do I get back? Oh, I just press it again. Okay. Uh, nothing that way. Okay. Dead end this way. Okay. Oh, okay. Keep going, I guess. Uh, pressing Q does absolutely nothing. Bastards, they're right. It does absolutely nothing. Why would they tell me that? Freaking trolling game. Uh, okay. Uh, what is this? There's a desk in the middle of the cornfield. I'm gonna tell you right now, that's not something you're gonna typically find in a cornfield. Items you can use will be added to your inventory. Story items will be added to your folio. Added to folio. How do I... Oops. How do I see my folio? Folio? But you didn't tell me how to look at it! You did a great job picking up that item. A new path has opened to you. Okay. It's very kind of you weird floaty thing on my screen there. That was weird. But how do I... We'll be back in question mark minutes. <gasps> how did I get that? A note lazily scribbled includes a stock greeting and encourages the reader to enjoy the complimentary snack on the desk. 
notes to the reader to mind the boxes and also says open the big door and will probably say hello. Okay, I open that with X. Okay. How do I eat? Oh. Oh. Okay, so that's right bumper does that. English muffin. How do I eat it? English muffin. Hard as granite. This muffin is most definitely nowhere near fit for consum 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 consumption. Despite how much you try. All you've done is given yourself a headache. <laughs> well, shit. Okay. Alright, so it opened the way to the boxes. Press E to examine your equipped item for clues on how to use it. Oh, I did that already on accident. Okay. So it's hard as a rock, so maybe we can break something with it. Fair enough. Mystery music. Can I break the stump? No. Windmill. Can I break the boxes? Nope, that's the note. Okay, we can't go that way. Alright. My path is blocked by bright orange boxes. Oh, there's a house. They have made the cornfields much less creepy. Oh. Press the space bar to look at the story items in your folio. That was the X. So it doesn't give you how to look at it with a controller, so that's fine though. What does that mean? The door that we looked at is that way, maybe? Uh, okay. Creepy wood statue carving. Really broken down car. Whoa. What's with the spooky music? What the hell? A lot of broken pots. Looks to be the cellar. Alright, well let's check out the house first. I'm not really sure what our goal is here yet. I have no idea. <laughs> All I know is that there's talking corn. And I think thought we were a teddy bear, but maybe we're not. Oh, barn is that way, but it looks blocked off. I can't remember if we're the teddy bear or if the teddy bear appears in the game somehow. Oh. When you see the place icon, you can use an item. Use the left mouse button. Oh, it's a locked door. Okay, so we need a key. Oh, hello. That's a really tall swing. Okay, so I don't think we can go anywhere in the house yet, which is fine. Um, oh, what's this? Why is there dooming music? Quit dooming me. What's this? A broken shovel handle. Equip inventory items by using the scroll wheel or the one and two keys. Okay, so I can just hit the right bumper and it scrolls through these. Okay. The windmill is that way, but it's still blocked off. Okay. Is this a chicken coop? Looks like a chicken coop. This is a fucking mess! Man! Okay, just gotta clean up. Oh, good. Okay, we can go in here. Those are definitely chicken feeders. I've seen that. That's for the water. <laughs> you can tell where I was raised. <laughs> well, is there nothing in here? What's the point of this? Oh, hey, there's a key. Oh, farmhouse key. Okay, cool. Now we can go in the house. Why would you keep your house key in the chicken coop? I mean, I'm scared of chickens, I guess. At least I used to be. So I guess that would be as good as a place as any. No matter how many times you press it, Q still does nothing. They're right. It still does nothing. Why do you keep tempting me with Q? It's really rude. Why do they still want to tempt me with that? What's this? A rusty nail jammed in the... Oh, do I need something? Ah, oh, it's a shitter! It's the shitter, guys! We found the shitter! That's a long way from the house. A mediocre rock added to the folio. Why do we put it in the folio? This is a rock you found near an outhouse. You don't know why you have it. It's absolutely mediocre in every way possible. Its name is Chauncey. Why the fuck did we name this mediocre rock? I don't know, but now we have a friend. Thank you so much, Chauncey, for joining us on this epic journey. I couldn't do it without you. 
Okay, do we have anything in our inventory that we can use? Can I use, can I use this? Oops. No. How about, probably not the handle. Probably not the key. No, okay. Oops. Can we look in the shitter? No, okay, it's gross. Oh, fuck. Uh, now I would say it's uh, farmhouse time. Oh, uh, completely useless for shoveling dirt, but helpful if you wanted to tip something over. You immediately think of the wardrobe on the second floor of the farmhouse because you didn't particularly like how it looked at you and would like to ruin its day. I haven't even been in the farmhouse yet, but thanks for the clue. I guess. What does this have to say? Oops. Your mind explodes with the possible uses of this item, but you settle on key to unlock a nearby farmhouse and never think of any other possibility again. <laughs> How useful. So I guess that's the one downfall, is it kind of gives away things that you haven't even seen yet, but that's okay. Oh, I don't think we tried the back door. Not even possible. Okay. Oh, it looks like there's stuff to touch in there. All right, I'm gonna touch it. It looked like a meat grinder. <laughs> I should probably put my hand in it. Whoa! Hey, visual glitch. Bing! Bing a ding a ding. We got it. Turn the lights on. All right. Oh gosh, it's dark in here. Hello? Hello? Oh, what's this? Uh. Statue Chew? An invoice for a commissioned wooden statue. Cost is in the hundreds of thousands. Items on the list include chopping down a large oak tree, carved statue out of oak tree, and hospital bills for injuries sustained <laughs> chopping down oak tree. Okay. Total due. Is that 2,500,000? Tax is 50,000? Those zeros seem in the wrong place. I'm confused. Okay. So that's that's the statue we saw out in the backyard, I'm assuming. Okay. Did they commission that? Oh, a John Deere hat. What does that say? A reindeer. <laughs> that's funny. Oh my god! Can you see the family up there? Oh, sweetie. Oh, sweetie. Oh, honey. Oh, oh, oh my goodness. That, oh, that's hot. Okay. All right, what's this? Um, a boring, a really boring mystery novel, Night Danger, a, a Mick, a Mick Murphy mystery by Reginald Higgin, Higginbottom, Bitbottom. Having no talent at the genre, the author mistakenly revealed the murderer's identity on the first page and spent the rest of the novel outline a outlining a story about the detective buying a pair of pants. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> I like the humor so far. It was pretty funny. It was good. What's this? A fruit crate. What the fuck am I gonna do with the fruit crate? <laughs> okay. A sausage grinder. Something's jammed inside. Despite what the name would suggest, the crate was specifically used to hold a, num a large number of pine cones in order to start a collection. The collection currently sits at zero. <laughs> Obviously. Thank you. Okay, so... I need something to get... Oh, that looks like the key! It looks like the key for the door is jammed in there. What's this? Rancid corn oil. Cool! I wonder what we're gonna use that for. Uh, an old sink. Okay, what's this? A bathtub plug. Oh, the sink is now plugged. Now what? Uh... What's this? Oh. Nail clippers! What am I gonna do with the nail clippers? Vigilant as you are when it comes to personal hygiene, the only two things these clippers will do for you are grip something launched in a wall and give you a 100% tetanus guarantee! 
That's it. They do look pretty gross. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Lovely. Uh, do you want me to put the oil in there? Yes. Okay. The smell is worse than imagined. Okay. So that's what you wanted me to do with that. I had a feeling. Uh, can I pull... I can't... I can't pull that out? Okay, not with that. Alright. Fair enough. Let's keep looking. I'm sure we'll find something else. Good. Oh, what's that? C to crouch and C again to not crouch. You can do this forever! What button is it on the controller, though? I don't... I don't have a button? Oh, I do have a button. <gasps> Unlocked a secret door, making it much less secret! <laughs> Oh, lovely. I'm so glad <laughs> I could make it much less secret. Ew. What the fuck happened down here? Alright. <laughs> making it much less secret. Okay. Oh my god! Is this supposed to be the Mona Lisa? Uh, sir. Oh my goodness. You're missing a fuse. Okay. On and off. That is a really big button. <laughs> this place is gross. Oh. Oh, that goes up here. Can I... Can I... Yay! I opened the cellar door so I can go up there if I want to. I can go up there if I want to. I can leave my friends behind. As if my friends don't dance and if they don't dance, well, you're probably not a friend of mine. Okay, so we need a fuse. Maybe that'll give us lights in the house? Cool. Alright, so I don't, I don't see anything else. Sounds are a little bit freaky in this game. Okay, I don't see anything else in that room. So I think we gotta go upstairs in the house? <laughs> Alright, and since the thing already gave us the clue about the wardrobe, push something over with our shovel stick. Okay, what's this? A bobby pin. What do you want me to? Oops. What do you want me to do with the bobby pin? Extremely useful for picking a lock, but you mistakenly thought it was a pencil, and wrote a very detailed account of your day up to that point, and didn't notice that there was no ink until a few hours later. Where did I put this account of of my day? <laughs> what the hell? Okay. Sure. I did that. I'm sure I did. Lovely. I'm an idiot. <laughs> How does this game know me so well? <laughs> Alright. Cool. Alright, so... Oh! Oh! You want the crate there? Okay. Alright, and then... You want... There. Oh! Oh! It's a fulcrum! We have leverage! Perfect. Okay. Is there anything else over here? No. Nope. Just stuff to tease me with. I see. How about in here? Just more boxes. Lots of boxes and shit in here. Okay. Okay, now what? Can I climb up here? There we go. Oh! Gosh, there's an upstairs? Damn. Gosh, this reminds me of my sister's house. <laughs> Alright. I don't like that. I don't like stuff being covered with sheets. You guys know me. It's, it's freaky. Stop it. Stop it. Okay. Uh. Oh! <laughs> that's a freaky gnome. Why are you recording me, sir? Okay, let's go touch the gnome. Oh, God, that's icky. Oh, that face is icky. Everything's icky. Can I touch this? Can't touch that. Okay. Can I crouch and look at that? No. Okay. I like that it tells you when you're crouched, so you have a really good warning. I like how things are also lit up. Burnt lab report. Much of it can't be read, but the words abject failure appear several times. So does hurt feelings and sentient cornstalks. And why did we do this? <laughs> it's down at the bottom. Jerks. Hurt feelings. <laughs> <laughs> to determine something extremely, extremely something. <laughs> okay. Ah, oh, latex gloves. <laughs> there 
right? Okay, the gnome is still there. Waiting for that shit to, like, disappear me. What the fuck? I've seen carrots like this before. Have you ever seen, like, one of those dual carrots with the legs? Those are weird. Why are they all in, like, little test tubes and shit? Uh, what is that? What, I, now I have a mallet. Uh, what does the mallet say? Smash something perfectly flat with this trusty tool. But remember, you can never unflatten things with this. It is the mallet's greatest weakness. Do I have something like that? I don't think I have that. Okay, so I have a mallet. Hello? Hello? Oh, what's that? Okay, um... We didn't find a fuse. I'm really not sure what that is. Oops. Oops. Oh, I can try- no, it's not the nail clippers. Oh, I don't know. Okay. So... I need this. Not that. Oops. Try that. Yay! Okay, pulled out the rusty nail with the nail clippers. What am I supposed to do with the nail? Uh, should I use the nail in the grinder thing, maybe? This might be a long way around. Let's try this. No, oh, it's a short way around. That was perfect. Okay, let's try this. Fuck! Okay, what do you want? What does it say? For some reason, the first thing that pops into your head, this would be a good conductor of electricity. Oh! You are very strange. Possibly is a fuse. Huh. Okay. Alright. Restored power to the farmhouse. It's slightly less dark than it was before. Cool. Alright. So now we have power. But now, what does that mean? Is that good? What are we gonna do with the uh, power? I'm falling. What's making that noise? Something's making noise. I still don't know what we're gonna do with the sink. Oh, hey, what's up? CD player. And a CD. I have an old CD. You picked up a CD? Good for you. A new path has been opened to you. To the barn in the silo! Woohoo! Top secret! Okay, I have a top secret CD. Oops. Oops. An old CD. Its label faded. Pressed on the first pressed on the first batch of CDs ever created. This brand was notoriously expensive and even more unreliable, making even the greatest of symphonies sound like something as something a concussed elephant would make while stumbling around a music shop. <laughs> How wonderful. Okay, so that's what we needed to do to get to the next area. And we need to go to the barn? Barn is this way. Cool, cool, cool. Alright, progress! We're doing it, we're doing it, and doing it, yeah. Doing it, and doing it, and do- Uh, hold the shift key to sprint. Fuck you, I already figured that out, bitch! And it's the left trigger. Na 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 na. What's the barn say? What? If you're stuck, remember press E to examine your equipped item for clues. Okay. I guess that's kind of nice to tell you that. The Great Kidney Cure. What does that say, though? Ba Butch? Butch you... Poopa? What? What? Butcha? Butcha? <laughs> what the- What the fuck does it say? Butchia, butch you? B u c h u. P. What? Fuck! I don't know. Great kidney care. I know it says great kidney care. Pretty, pretty sure it says great kidney care. I need a great kidney care. Care my kidneys. Care my kidneys. Oh God. Help me. Am I gonna die in this game? I have a health affair. Creepy barns are, are where it's at. 
where it's at. Do, 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 do. A book titled Corn of the World. Okay. A book outlining the differences and similarities of corn species across the globe. Several chapters also discuss the color yellow. A few species are circled in red pen, while no, no, no appears in many places across the entire book in blue pen. Nope. <laughs> okay. Somebody's really excited about uh, vegetables. Farm stuff. I know we're going to get sentient talking corn. I'm, just, I'm very excited for it. I'm very, very excited. When are we going to get it? When are we gonna 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 get it? I get a broom? Broom. Oops. What do I do with the broom? There's a pile of something or other you can sweep up with this, but you already knew that. What you didn't know was that this broom is haunted. This will not affect your adventure in any way, but as the ghost is currently away on business. Lovely. One half of a diagram. A diagram torn in half contains very complicated looking equations scribbled in orange pen. A drawing of a person and a DNA helix looks very important. You tried to eat it at first, but changed your mind when you couldn't find any salt. What? Why did I try to eat it? What's wrong with me? Okay. Why are there like clothes everywhere? Is this- oh! Is this for a- this looks like materials for a, um, a scarecrow. Like, there's boots, and a partially stuffed hand, and a hat, and straw everywhere, and a partially stuffed hand, and another boot. I'm getting a little fucking creeped out here, guys. I don't like that. Oh, no. What the hell is that? Get <laughs> All right, so here's Tana's area. Tana would be, I could imagine her sitting right there, pumping on here. <laughs> All right, now what? Is, is that what I needed? Was it broom? Okay. Maybe we need to go find the silo area next. <laughs> is there a jump button? I'd like a jump button, please. All right, let's go to the side. Oh, there's a silo. Nice. Lovely. Just waiting for some zombies to come out. All right. Oh, arrows this way. Comforting. Yes, yeah, silo. Thank you. Very kind of you. What is that? Electricity that way. Okay, but let's do the silo. So we know that we opened up the way to the silo. I got my broom for my protection. My protective broom. Okay, all right. So, a padlock. Well, we have a bobby pin. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Even though I used it as a pen for my diary. What, what is this? Can I take this grain? This is not takeable. A pile of corn kernels. Can I? Ah! I cleared the pile of corn kernels, and now I have a needle nose pliers. What's this? Oh! I'm just gonna carry this fucking telescope around with me! Okay! An old telescope. Manufactured about a century ago, this telescope's effective range is the tops of low hanging trees. <laughs> Possibly because its lenses were put on backwards. <laughs> Looks like it was used frequently with varying results. <laughs> it's pretty though. <laughs> oh, this rug is so wrinkled. I hate it. Oh, it's bothering me. A weathered, tattered blueprint added to folio. Though it's hard to make out, this blueprint looks like it's for the construction of a very large, very poorly planned facility with a farm situated on top of it. The facility itself actually set an architectural architect textural record for having the largest number of corridors that led absolutely nowhere. Why did we build all of this? <laughs> lovely. Just lovely. Okay. Cool. 
<laughs> I really like the comedy in this game so far. I find it highly entertaining. I think it's quite clever. Maybe I'm just silly. Alright, so the only way we haven't been is this way so far. Maybe it'll let us go this way. Stop pressing Q! I haven't been pressing Q! But you make me want to press it, you you dink. <laughs> Stop pressing Q. Psh. Make me. Make me, bitch. What's this? A fake tool thing. Just stand in there. Oh! Oh no! Uh, a gloved, severed hand. What am I Oh, the hands for the door! Oh. A very fashionable fedora. Wait, what does it say about this? A severed hand, perfectly preserved in the glove that encases it. It could come in handy if you could give yourself a hand and find a way to loosen and get that glove off. The first pun was intended, but not the second. <laughs> a, fashionable ha a very fashionable fedora. A very fashionable fedora worn by a very fashionable person. Due to this, you are not putting it on your head, as you have not earned the right. On the inner tag, <laughs> the owner wrote his name. Fernando. <laughs> okay. What's this? A charred name tag. It took several hours of staring, but you managed to deduce that the name tag, in fact, belongs to the dead person it was near, and that his name is Fernando. It took you several more hours to notice that the dead person was a lab assistant. I, I could see that. It looks like lab ass. <laughs> and that five whole, and then five more minutes to realize you were trying to read the thing upside down the whole time. Oh, am I like really dumb? Like really, really dumb? <laughs> okay, so. Do we need to go back to the door and use this? Or do we need to use all the things at once on the door, do you think? Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> this game just makes me giggle. <laughs> oh, okay. This is probably a good spot to pause and um, stop this recording. I've uh, been recording for quite a bit of time, so thank you so much for watching. I'm Joyful Death. I stream... Uh, several days a week on Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday from uh, 9 p.m. to 1 a.m. Central Standard Time and also on Fridays from 1 p.m. to 4 p.m. Uh, in the afternoon at Central Standard Time as well. And I, I, <laughs> I hope you had a good time with this. This gave me a lot of giggles. I don't know if you've seen this game before or not. This is my first time ever looking at it. I've never watched anybody play it before. And it gives me the giggles. I think it's funny so far. Let me know what you think in the comments. Do you like it? You want me to keep playing it? I think I will so far. It's been it's been clever. Um, the puzzle aspect of it isn't too bad so far. So I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. Uh, yeah. So I look forward to seeing you in the next one. And don't forget to see me over in the live streams. You can also follow me on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and on my Discord. All the links will be below. And uh, yeah. Love you guys. Have a wonderful, wonderful rest of your day. Thank you. Bye.